Zero FXB, welcome to my channel. TRX one or two made by Whistler. So look here, there is an Android server and client that can provide you with a app that will go on your Android device and you can run your scanner. Now, big thank you straight away at the bottom here to Paul Anderedge for his initial investment, and then we've got some other names here, Ray. Uh, NK, uh, for the NK50 and more. So definitely I'll put the link in the description so you can see that. And look at some of these screenshots here of the APK in action. It's showing all the information, location, you know, you can see the details there. Some nice screenshots here. So what do you do? How do you run this? Well, I haven't got the TRX1 yet. It's coming tomorrow. You download, if you scroll down here, you download the server and the APK at the same time. There's, there's three different versions here, but the newest one is uh, 2021. So you click that and drag that to your mobile phone. It will install the APK and then run the other one on your computer. And you will end up on your computer with this, this window here. You can see on the right hand side. Now, as far as I can see on the, on the Windows part, we're going to put in the serial port of our Whistler 1 or 2. Then if you look at the app, if you look at the, you can see it in the background, there's some settings in there and you configure the IP address of your computer. And, and I think pretty much away you go. Now, obviously I can't do this because I haven't got it and I haven't got the device, but this is just a, a video to show you some links here. And the other thing I've tested is that the, the sort of code plug, let's call it, that you install into the Whistler TRX1 stroke 2 are interchangeable. So if you look here at the, the software that I've been looking at, I imported this from the TRX2 and it's going to go onto the TRX1. I haven't got the TRX2 either. Uh, but as soon as they come, we're going to give all this a go. So links in the description for this suite and anything else you might need. Sounds great that you can walk around and run your scanner and listen to it. Once it's connected to your, say, external, very good antenna, Probably, you can walk yeah. around your house and you can go through and listen to air band, marine band, you know, all the things that we love to listen to as scanner enthusiasts. So thanks for watching my Probably, channel yeah. and catch you soon. 7-3, all the best.